Understanding your food costs in your restaurant is incredibly important. And often we wonder, is there a food cost calculator out there? Well, the truth is there's not, but there is a formula. I'm gonna share that with you in about two seconds. Hello, this is Dave Scott Peters, creator of the Restaurant Prosperity Formula. And I know we often look for the easy way out. We're looking for that food cost calculator. We just type in a couple numbers, bang. Well, yeah, there is kind of a calculator. If you set up a spreadsheet or use software, but it's really the formula or the math that goes behind it. And what is that? That's beginning inventory. That comes from when? Your past inventory, the product that you started with in this month or this week on the shelves. Then we have our purchases. Our purchases are based on accrual accounting, earn OUs. Doesn't matter whether you pay for that invoice or not, if it crosses your back threshold, that food product is a cost today. So our beginning inventory plus our purchases, we add those together and that's our total amount of product we could use. If we close our restaurant today, that's how much money we have sitting on the shelves. Then at the end of the period, either whether it's at the end of the month or preferably end of the week, we take another inventory. What is the value of the product sitting on my shelves? Beginning inventory plus purchase tells us what we could sell. Minus our ending inventory gives us our use, the product that actually leaves the shelves. Now we hopefully sell it, right? That's the number one way we hope we use our product. We sell it to our guests, but we could have had it stolen. We could have wasted it, spoiled it. We could have taken it home ourselves as an owner and not put it in the register because we own the damn restaurant. Well, all those things show a false use of product and we need to control all those things. Bottom line is the math doesn't know. Beginning inventory plus purchases minus ending gives me use. Use is what leaves the shelves, no matter how it leaves the shelves. Then we take our gross sales before discounts, not including sales tax. Use divided by sales, that is your food cost percentage. So ultimately, if you wanna measure your restaurant's food costs, the calculation, the formula is beginning inventory plus purchases minus ending gives us use, use divided by sales is food cost. The key is understanding what your food cost is so you can put controls in place to keep it in line, to make the money you deserve. I will tell you on a side note, make sure you search my channel for a prime cost video so you can learn where your food costs should be because calculating is one piece, knowing where you should be in order for you to make money is a whole nother idea.